you guys watched Gotcha World, um, I lied. <laughs> I got to at the end. I said I was going to hit the bed because it's late because it's only like fucking 11.30. God damn it. I was trying to show you the thing. See? 11.30. Um, but I haven't recorded anything. I've been on a little break because um, uh, my leg got fucked up during work on Wednesday. And I've pretty much been off work since uh, this past Wednesday. I don't know what day exactly that was, but this past Wednesday, uh, fucked my leg up, and now my next check's gonna get fucked. So, I can't start the recording off the consoles yet, which sucks. I really wanted to do that this month, but, uh, so much stuff started popping up, I had to pay, um, so, yeah, that stuff has to go first, so yeah. Um, but yeah, uh, I've just been on rest, I've been thinking about how everything's going, um, because... I don't know, I wasn't, I have not been happy at the moment. Um, I've been actually stressed out a lot. Um, stressed out more than usual, actually. And it's, it fucks up my entire, like, thing that I do. Uh, like with editing, uh, recording, everything. Like, it just fucks up everything to where I just don't want to, I don't want to do it. I don't want to touch it, I don't want to mess with anything. So, that is why I didn't do anything for a while. Because of that stuff. I mean, I even had time to upload To the Moon. And I finished To the Moon. I finished two episodes of To the Moon. I haven't touched anything from the teacher. I haven't touched anything from anything else. But, um... Yeah. Uh... I've just pretty much just been on a vacay, I guess you could say. Because I've just been so stressed out how everything's been going. So, yeah. Um, I'm off my vacay, I guess you could say. And now we're going to continue this shit. So, in the last episode of The Teacher, I don't fucking remember what happened because it's been so long. So let's jump on into it. For the best experience, please use your headphones. I don't see what the headphones will do for you. I'm being honest. I don't see what it does. I hate how that fucking thumbnail came out, by the way. I wish I could have done so much better with it. Oh, okay, just jump us on in. Okay, cool. Whole way home, the sexology class played on repeat in my- Oh, god damn, I forgot about that. Never mind, now I remember what happened in the last episode. The sex episode, like, oh my god, it's so cool. You. I uploaded that episode, right? Yeah, I did. <laughs> I don't know why, that sort of threw me off a second. I was like, did I upload that? Yeah, I did. Okay. Especially the golden moment with me and Mr. Collins. Ew. Thinking about his eyes, looking into mine, gave me goosebumps and let me suck. <laughs> I ain't sighing. I don't remember ever feeling this. Ever feeling this love struck by a man's look. Oh my god. Man's looks before. Why am I reading this? But Mr. Collins looked in his. in this. in a league on its own. Melane. M Meline? Melane? I don't know. Melane, one of my classmates, has already bragged about her plan to go to at least second base with Mr. Collins. That's... What the fuck? So inappropriate. Let's just say that. So inappropriate. But I wouldn't expect anything else from her. She's not exactly known for uh, respecting rules and laws. So you know what I mean? Like, she's a slut. <laughs> My first day is a nanny starts tomorrow. I'd better start packing. Oh yeah, I gotta move in that nanny's home. I forgot about that. I also have a date with Jake in a couple of hours that I need to get ready for. Let's start with packing some things, then I'll pack the rest tomorrow morning before I leave. Why do people do this? Why don't you just pack and get fully... Don't get undressed here. What the hell's wrong with you? I she was getting undressed. I was like, nah, -uh, not here. One hour later. God fucking damn it. Why didn't you just wear that to bed? A shower did me good. <laughs> now I just need to get changed for my date. Something. <laughs> Can I go back on this? Let me try out the other outfit. Something sexy. Ooh. That doesn't look sexy. Like, that looks, I like that. That looks cute. Something casual. I guess we'll go something sexy, like, God. 
I mean, it looks cool. Like, it looks... I wouldn't say it looks sexy, because, I mean, it's a dress. And the, the sexy would be, like, skin-tight pants. Red top. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not a fucking woman. Perfect! Oh, good what should I do with my hair? Curl it, straighten it, put it up, leave it as it is. Curl it up, let's see. Oh, fuck no. No, 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 no. Straighten it. What the fuck? Can she not have long hair? Put it up. Gonna be honest with y'all. Um, curl it. it. It looks perfect. Perfect! What it look? I'm ready. And just in time, Jake's here. How convenient! The assassin fit. <laughs> God damn it. Really? Way to have it. Well, I don't blame you. Fucking episodes does it on its own with mean girls. Great! Now that we're here, will you please tell me which movie you picked? Hmm, I'm thinking I should just let you find out when the movie starts. Way well, you have no time to escape. Oh, well, you thought this through, haven't you? You know me. Come on, just. I mean, come on, just tell me. Okay, fine, only because you and surprises don't go very well together. You know me too. We're going to watch the Assassin Femi Fatal. I guess that's one way to advertise yourself. <laughs> that's one way to advertise yourself. Is it some kind of lame take on the action movie that's filled with romance and an action movie for women? Oh yeah. And you're gonna love it. I doubt it. We're going in anyway, come on! Are we making fun of my voice? Yeah! You're spot on! Oh, thanks, babe. <laughs> I need help. Oh, man, I need help. Okay. They kiss! Finally! Oh, God. Why do I look pissed? Really? I've obediently followed him to countless of horror action movies these past couple of years. I've watched them, even if they weren't exactly my cup of tea, just because I respected his choice. But whenever it's the other way around, he won't do the same for me. He... It's, it's a movie. <laughs> it's a movie. Like, yeah, it's not gonna be like... You gotta understand, people have different tastes. Like, yeah, though... You probably didn't like the movies, you still like, you know... Like, faked your way through it. Why not just tell them the truth? Like, eh, the movie could have been better. I mean, hell, that's what my mom and her dude do. They, like, talk about movies. She likes some movies. He doesn't like some movies. And they fucking talk about it. And, like, say what they don't like and dislike. Why the hell do you gotta fake it? Just because you respect this toy? Psh, psh. That's not how it works, dummies. If you guys think so, you'll need help. It wasn't always like that, though. In the beginning, he would do anything to make me smile. He was always focused on me and my feelings, but now, it's a whole other story. Sad thing is, it doesn't bother me enough for me to get mad about it anymore. Wow, okay. I know he doesn't do this to hurt me. I know why we're doing this to each other. It's hard to accept it, but I know it's because we've grown apart. We don't really have anything in common anymore besides school. There's no way around it. I need to talk to him. Okay, look. Uh, Jake. Go fu- Is that two guys kissing over there? If so, respect it, I guess. Sort of. Nah, yeah, I respect it. Okay, look. Um, no shit. Jake. Look, um... I don't know what this- we need to talk? This isn't working? Do you love me? That seems too much. Um, this isn't working. Let's go easy. We need to talk. And let me turn it up a bit, because to be honest, the music sounds nice on this one. We need to talk about us. I've been thinking about that too, Mia. You have? Yeah. Look, I really care about you, Jake. I always... I will always care about you. 
I know, and I hope you know I care a lot about you too. I do, it's just... The sparks... They're not there. Exactly. Oh, at least... Thank you, at least... At least... We're both on the same page. Okay, that's the way you should go. I think we're both on the same page here, so let's just... I'm glad we both feel the same way. Me too. We're still friends, right? Of course. Da 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 da. Man. Ah, it was a weird sensation that flew through my body right there in that moment. A feeling of losing something which made me sad but also a sense of relief came over me. I was happy that Jake felt the same way. It made everything a lot less hurtful. This was just the last drop, the drop that made us realize the fact that this thing we've gone up going on is substantially blah, 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 blah. <laughs> substantial isn't such substantial fuck anymore. God damn it. Can't fucking read. It's, it's 11. Shut up. We ended everything that night with one last kiss. I mean, you could have showed it. It's Saturday, and today I move in with the Collins. I've already been looking forward to this. I need to look presentable and professional today. So I picked out three cute... <laughs> of course, three cute outfits last night. Now I just need to figure out which one of them to wear. <sighs> what should I wear? <laughs> Let's see. Oh, fuck no. What are you thinking? No, 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 no. Uh-uh, girlfriend. Uh-uh. Um, what else is there? Find a Oh my fucking god. No. Uh, it looks around your age. The other two look too old for you. I'm being completely honest. Perfect. Now, wait, did it still give me those options? My hair stayed curled? Curl it. I mean, it looks it looks nice curled, so we'll just leave it curled. Fuck y'all. Perfect. Great, I'm ready. My bags are packed. Let's do this. Dun, 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 dun. Doorbell ringing. Not coming. Why were you doing that? I don't know. Hello, Mia. Good to see you. You look very pretty today. Hey, miss. Uh, um. Oh, uh, I mean... Ellie! And thank you! So do you! Oh, do you think so? Thank you, dear. I had to go buy some last-minute things before I leave, so I asked Daryl to show you around. I hope that's okay with you. Sure, of course. Daryl! The new nanny is here. You should be here soon, so, uh, you know, I think you guys must be around the same age. Dale might be a bit older than you. He's like 24. How old are you again, sweetie? I'm 18. <laughs> I saw an all too familiar handsome man walk towards us. At first, I thought my eyes were playing tricks on me because I've been thinking about him so much. <laughs> no! <laughs> That's right. Really, look at that, Miss Rose, right? <laughs> no, well, seems like you two have already met. You haven't fucked yet, have you? No. But no, there he was. Standing right in front of me with his deep brown eyes, pearly white teeth, and muscular figure. Was my new tall, dark, and handsome teacher. Oh, was my new tall, dark, and handsome teacher. Oh, yes, uh, we, he's, uh, I'm 18. <laughs> Dumbass. <laughs> you seem nervous, Miss Rose. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, you just uh, surprised me, that's all. I stuttered. Um, was I, where was I? Uh, oh, yes, uh, your new son is uh, my teacher, Ellie. <laughs> Huh, what a funny little coincidence, huh? Anyway, I gotta go. See you later, bitches. Yeah, <laughs> funny. <laughs> See you later, Mom. Or Mother, whatever your name is. Yeah, bye, bitch. Bye, ho. Oh, yeah, you guys love each other. I was definitely not expecting this. 
Well, seems like we're going to spend a whole lot of time together, huh? Quick question, can he go to jail for that? Because my mind's going there, because it's the teacher, come on. Come on, we know what's going to happen here. <laughs> I felt like my heart was going to beat out of its, my chest. He is way too attractive to say something like that to a hopeless girl. I was nervous as hell. My mind was going crazy with impure thoughts of him and I. Alone in this big house. <gasps> Get your shit together, Mia. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess so. So, two of the house. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, relax. This is weird for me, too, but don't worry. I'm not going to give you a detention if you make my little sister cry or anything. <laughs> Getting a detention is exactly why I'm nervous. I bet he knows that already, too. I can literally feel my brain turn into goo. I don't suppose I can say anything right now without humiliating myself. Think out loud, stutter. Think out loud. That's a great song. The tension with you doesn't sound so bad. What the hell, Mia? Uh, what did you just say? What? Nothing! Hey, shit! I think a deep breath will help, Miss Rose. Uh, better? Yeah, um, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry about it. Anyway, um, this is the hall up there. It's Kylie's room. She's not at home right now. I'll show it to you later. Yeah, okay, sure. Let's get going after you, Miss Rose. A gentleman, too. Mr. Right here might give me a heart attack soon if he keeps that up. Mm. Thank you, Mr. Collins. Da 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 da. Fuck you. My god, how long is this? He showed me around the magnificent mansion room by room. Kylie's room. It was very formal, I almost didn't even dare to look at him. I was honestly afraid that my eyes would blow up with giant hearts if I looked at him. Ah, I remember that house! The kitchen was modern and spacious. I could definitely see myself cook there. Sipping on cocktail and stuff. No, I'm too young to drink. <sighs> Da, da 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 The garden, which I earlier got a quick glimpse of, was beautiful. He told me that his mother was very fond of gardening, and she took care of all the flowers herself. No wonder she had such a hard time leaving her roses. A year is a long time. I felt bad for her, but I also really respected her for what she wanted to do for her mother. I would have done the same thing for my mother if she didn't die, you know what I mean? <laughs> wow, this place is great. And this is my favorite room, the Man Cave. Yeah, very cool, cool. Um, wrong way. I knew that. I was just testing your ass. Embarrassing. Oh, I was just looking around. <laughs> of course you were, Miss Rose. <laughs> Dumbass. Fuck you. Fuck you. Guessing this is your office? Where is my room? This ain't my room, is it? No, this has to be his office. Is this my room? Actually, it's my room in my office. Oh. I was standing in my teacher's bedroom. This was his bed. He's been sleeping here. This is a bad idea. How am I supposed to focus on anything when he's everywhere? <laughs> You're welcome to share with me, but I'm sure you'd rather have your own room, right? O.M.G. I'm not sure if I'm... If he meant that as a flirtatious gesture, or if he just tried to be funny. <laughs> but my mind is overflowing with Stevie comebacks right now. Maybe I'd share some laughing right now. Are you crazy? I can't say that. Who are you? Maybe. <laughs> Who are you? Are you trying to make me seduce this guy? Maybe I am. Well, you better stop that! Can't you see I'm struggling to stay away from him already? <laughs> she fought with herself. What the fuck? Oh, I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean it to yell at you. He's just too damn sexy and it's really frustrating. Huh. 
Look, I'm going to pretend I'd rather have my own room in a classy and mature way. Is she talking to me? What the fuck? You can't break the fourth wall here, bitch. You got a problem with that? No, no, yes. <laughs> well, you're not helping me. You better behave. Jesus. I'm trying to get me fired on the first day. I think it's better if, uh, I mean, I would like my own room, please. <laughs> That's what I thought. There's not much space in here anyway. Well then, let me show you to your room. Da -da 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 -da. God fucking damn! She's fucking psychotic. She's talking to me. Hey, here's what's the name Zoom. Whoa! Oh shit! Oh, that looks nice. T this is my room? It's all yours. Thank you so much. I love it. I thought you mind. It's a bit nicer than mine, right? Now you be quiet. Don't you try and sabotage just me. Sabotage me again. Seriously, who are you anyway? Are you my evil conscience or something? <laughs> oh, yes, I am your conscience. <laughs> my dream has come true. Well, Conscience, try and help me make good decisions, would you? I know it's hard, but please try. For me, okay, good, yeah. Room is nice, too, but the room is definitely just my style. <laughs> there we go, good Conscience, much better. Fuck you. I swear to God. <laughs> well, that was basically it. I'll let you unpack and settle in. Thank you so much. And thank you for showing me around. No problem. I have some papers to grade. You know where to find me if you need anything. Try and joke with him. That is if I don't get lost in here. <laughs> this place is pretty big, yes, but I can make you a map if that'll help. Score! He jumped on the fun wagon. And might I just add that his laugh is to die for. Anyway, I'll see you later. Yeah, okay. Hmm. Oh, I don't remember where my papers went. Hey, um, oh, and Miss Rose. Yeah. Welcome to your new home. Oh, thank you. You want to sleep with me? <laughs> In the next episode, he answers. Oh, God. <laughs> Bitch was fighting with me. What the fuck? You can't do that. You can't fucking do that. Fuck you, lady. What time is it? Oh my god. <laughs> Scott, why am I here? Um, how would I rate this? Uh, no, fuck it. Five. I'm giving it five. It's actually pretty good. I like it. The game, this thing is actually pretty damn good. I enjoy it a lot. So fuck it, we're gonna do that. And also, best part, I don't have to spend gems at all. Which is something I am glad about. Thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, share this video with your guys' friends. You guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next episode of The Teacher. Bye, guys.